Your date of birth holds all the secrets to your soul. Oh? You give us your date of birth, we'll tell you the secrets to love, the secrets to lust, and who the best person for you just might be. I have the answers. Check out Secrets of Birthdays at secretsofbirthdays.com. Hello, Scorpio. Welcome back from the weekend. Thanks for logging in to Soul Garden. Well, you're partly sunny, you're nesting and resting today. The moon has moved into Aquarius, and although we've just come from a weekend, this is your first day spiritually off. You're going to need extra loving care today, and it's going to be up to you to give it to yourself. So carve that space today. may make you cranky if you don't get it. You're emotionally highlighted when it comes to your self-nurturing consciousness, the part of you that checks in on yourself or doesn't. So it is emotionally uh, charged. So if that part of yourself is happy, you might feel really centered, grounded, and amazing today. If that part of yourself is not content, you may be a little emotional today. Really determines, it's based on how well you have been energetically investing in your inner mother. Now, zip it to the sun. We're in chapter one of Sun in Taurus. We had a breakdown on Sunday, and today I'm predicting breakthrough. Now, the topic for Scorpios is your ability to manage and balance your life and relationships. That's what you're working on. So somewhere over the weekend, an out-of-balance life, an out-of-balance relationship probably broke down, most likely Sunday morning or Saturday night, to be specific. Today, it's time to figure out how did that happen? What is it about your approach to relationships that's not working? Or your approach to the people you choose is not working? Remember, don't blame someone else. You decided to be in that relationship. This is a state of free will. So you're wasting your time saying they're a loser. You picked them. So now it's time to really figure out what's up. Or if you're single, this might be a, a, a breakdown of like, okay, why am I not manifesting? Now here's the good news, Scorpio. Jupiter moving into this space June 5th is going to help you carry into happy, content, balanced partnerships and marriages. But we've got to get to the bottom of why you haven't been in one so far. And that's what today is about. Now Mercury says simultaneously that you may have a breakthrough realization about your life at large today. Mercury went direct over the weekend, thank goddess, and it's not wasting any time. In fact, it says, Scorpio, there's a new breakthrough way of looking at your life or looking at the moment, and it means you might have to make some changes with your faith or face a weed in your soul garden. That's because it is opposing that Jupiter, which is hard in chapter three in Sun and Aries, or in Aries. And it's Monday, I have Julie Zipper starting off meditation vibration today talking about Earth and the power of Mother Earth, this big, spiritual, uh, amazing source of energy beneath our feet. How often do you really connect to Earth? She connects to you every day. Julie will help you connect in a spiritual way everywhere the garden is blooming. All right, Scorps, that's all I got for you today, but tomorrow things get a little creative. Till then, live, love, be. So God.